So I've had a lot of people ask me over the years, uh, how do I transition from rhythm to lead? Uh, I know how to play rhythm, I know my chords, but I don't know how to take off on lead. Should I play, learn my scales? Should I practice my scales? And uh, and so what I'm going to do today is just going to kind of give you a little heads up and uh, kind of a simple way to to make that transformation from rhythm to lead. Um, I know once you get past your, your basic G, C, and D, you know, F chords, from there usually people will transition into bar chords. So G, you know, the A. And the, the D, so to, to, you, then you learn your bar chords and you're able to play, you know. So in order to simplify this and to get you started on lead, uh, what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to start with a let's start with a D D chord. Of course, you play the D chord like this. So what I want to do, I want to use the three middle strings. That's the, the, the D, G, and the B. And we're going to start with a D chord like this. So second finger on the third B string. Second fret, first, first finger on the G string. Then the D on the fourth fret. So it looks like that. So that's a D. So before we go on from there, let's let's talk about another D. So I can slide to here and get another D, which would be like if you were an A, right? Playing an A, but we're just we're shifting it down to there, and then we're going to move it on up to here and get a D there, which is your F position, right? So we're playing those three notes. So, so there is so much you can do with those three strings. And uh, this is, I'm just going to give you a couple little exercises on, on how to start to break into lead. So, uh, and, and the neat thing is, is you can put these together. So let's start down here. Uh, from this position, I'm not even going to talk about scales. We're going to, so you can basically start in any of those strings. Like, things out of that position. Now, moving to this one. Right? So you can, uh, there's a lot of neat stuff you can do out of just in those three strings. And move, moving on up to here. It's more of a blues thing from there. And then back to there. And back to the original position. So connecting them. quick a little lesson there and uh so i'm gonna do some more just take off from there and go a little deeper but this will get you started 